Hello friends! Paragliding may seem as an interesting and not very dangerous activity, especially in comparison with other similar sports, but the story of one paraglider became famous around the world. She didn't just fly through a storm, but almost died from lightning strikes and a hailstorm. Fortunately, she managed to survive, but she hardly remembers anything. So let's find out what happened to her. Eva Vishnierska is a famous paraglider, winner of multiple championships as a member of the German national paragliding team, even though she is of Polish descent. However, she isn't only known as one of the best in her field, but also as the most fortunate woman in the world. That's because of an incident that happened to her in 2007 when Eva was 35 years old. Eva and 199 other participants took part in scheduled training flights. The woman was training for the Paragliding World Championship, which was coming up soon. The training flights took place in February and all participants were warned in advance that there was some degree of danger and that storm cells should be avoided. Everything was good at first, there was no sign of trouble, but then Eva got sucked into one of those storm cells and nearly died. Because of the bad weather conditions, the glider got carried to an extreme height, higher than Mount Everest. Surviving in these conditions is highly unlikely. The temperature dropped to negative 40 degrees and there wasn't enough oxygen. Due to the sharp ascent and the lack of oxygen at an altitude of over 9,947 meters, Eva lost consciousness and didn't come to her senses for about an hour. It's the height at which passenger jets fly. But the people inside are protected from the harsh weather conditions. The paraglider came to her senses and wanted to direct the glider past the cloud, but she couldn't do it. At a speed of 20 meters per second, the woman was getting sucked into a thundercloud. She lost consciousness again. When she came to, she checked the instruments, which showed that she had already descended a little and was flying at an altitude of 6,900 meters. She had no brakes in her hands, her whole body was frozen and she couldn't move her hands. Her gloves were covered with ice. There was no way for her to control the glider so it flew on its own wherever it could. According to Eva, the thundercloud she got sucked into was extremely strong. She didn't even know the words to describe this kind of natural power. Eva was getting shaken and thrown from side to side. It got completely dark and then she lost consciousness. Lightning constantly struck and flashed around her and then the hailstorm began. The hailstones were about 15 millimeters in size and they hit Eva directly, causing her whole body to be bruised. By the will of fate, she was carried away from the thundercloud. The altitude gradually decreased and the athlete fell near Niagara, 60 kilometers away from the start. What's also very surprising is that the glider didn't get damaged and continued to fly. Her ears were frozen and almost fell off. According to the experts, Eva only managed to survive because she lost consciousness, as it caused her heart and her whole body to slow down, thus saving her life. Well, that's it, guys. Like our video, leave us a comment, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.